first I want to give uh, give uh, Nichols uh, a lot of credit. I, 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 um, I was looking down at that coach. I've been in that situation. You know, he's 28 years old and his first head coaching job and doing that. And I've been there before. And so I thought about him all day today. And so uh, I want to give him a lot of credit. I thought he did a great, good job. I thought he had his kids prepared. I thought they played extremely hard. Kind of hit us in the mouth early. Um, you know, especially knowing that we, you know, not having uh, our leader and, and Forbes there. So um, wasn't the best defensive thing out there. I mean, we were able to score. Um, but when you're, you know, he does so much for us in regards to the middle of our defense. But our defense wasn't bad. Just giving up 15 offensive rebounds to, you know, I, I thought that killed us. But um, early in the year, you know, we were, we were able to come and win the game. Um, and so that, I think that's the most important part. Um, offensively, you know, we were able to get whatever we want. But just got to make sure defensively and, and, and rebounding. That we got to get better. So. Yeah, we had a huge run back uh, for like 12 straight points there when you needed it late in the first half. I saw that in China too. Yeah, you know, offensively, I, 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 I knew we were going to be able to get whatever we wanted. Um, um, I'm just disappointed about where we were defensively. Um, we've got a good basketball team, and we got to learn that we just can't turn it on and off like that. And we had, to be honest with you, we had the same problem a little bit this summer. You know, um, you know, I, you know. Sometimes I, I, don't, I don't think that we we do a good enough job as a staff to make sure that you know that we don't take people for granted. You know, and we 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 can't be living on how good we think we are. And so um, um, we just got to continue to work to get better. But um, I. I told our staff the other this is that a couple of years ago when I first got here, we probably lose a game like that, you know. So, uh, but again, I want to give him credit. You know, he played some older dudes and they, they, they did a good job. Sam, what do you think changed the most? You guys got down 12, uh, Ryan, the second half, you were able to take control. What, what did you have to do? What was the adjustments you guys Yeah, at the end of the day, um, we got a whole bunch of guys who care about winning, and we were just able to kind of flip the switch. Like the coach said, we were able to score as much as we wanted, but all we were able to do was string a few uh, stops together in order to stretch it. And we still wanted more stops and stop after stop. We weren't able to get that completely down the stretch. But when we were scoring the way we could, we were able to keep it at 10 or so and finish the game. It felt, felt good. Uh, we work on that in the offseason. Uh, great pass, Colby. We'll take those all day long. Colby, you had that stretch where you scored like 12, 30 points at Stratton. Um, just, just the flow of the game, just letting the game come to me, uh, taking it play by play. Um, my guys, my guy, just finding me too as well. Making open shots is, is key for this team. And you know what I'm saying? Um, so we, we, we still got to get better on the second half on the floor. But that, that, that was a good stretch for us. They get, they get us more back in the game and comfortable. Uh, most of the rebounding discrepancy came early, I guess. Yeah. Is that, the most, is that just the most frustrating part? Yeah, I, I mean, my frustration, honestly, isn't about the rebounding because you know how I feel about rebounding. I mean, we, we were able to – we forced them 18 turnovers. Yeah. And so when you have 18 turnovers, there's 18 opportunities we don't get a chance to get a rebound. So, um, um, so the rebounding thing is that the 15 offensive that, that we shouldn't have been able to give up. But, um, but again, I just uh, – I think I'm probably more frustrated because, again, I've, you know, we, we've started – it seems like we always start the year off with something. And so uh, um, we hope to have our have our guy back, but we got a good team. We just we 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 just got to understand that you know it, it's different because no one used to care about playing us. Now people really care and they get up. And so we've got to make sure we're ready. This is this kind of remind me when when we got off the plane and played China, almost almost identical, same type of thing, you know. But what's good about it is that we now know how to win. It took me a long time to get. They know how to win. There's no panic, you know. Um, um, it's actually, you know, in, in a way, a good test that they jumped on us early like that and got down 12. But I was not going to call a timeout. We would got bombed out. I, we could have got down 100. I said, I'm not calling a timeout. So I heard my staff say, I said, one more guy tells me timeout, you're fired. And so uh, they may not say it the rest of the year now, but, <laughs> but we were not calling a timeout. I wanted them to play through that. So. Um, is it too early in the way to jail? Are we ready Thursday? Too early. Too early. Um, you know, he's probably about 75%. They're, they're, if this was a conference game or later on, I probably would have played him. It just makes no sense um, right. in, in that regards. And so, uh, but I was happy with Jordan Wood. I thought Jordan Wood came up and, and, and did play some good minutes. He didn't make a, you know, some shots, but I thought he earned more playing time today. Yeah, yeah, and I mean, it was just. 
his length, you know, 6'9", his length, and so, uh, um, so he's a, uh, I, I think that was, you know, sometimes you, know, you got to find some things, and so I think we found something there. Uh, because, again, his length helps us defensively and, and, and maybe even on the class. So. Well, what makes it such explosive score? Because Dawson runs like that in China, too. Yeah, you know, he's, a, he's, a, he, he's been coached by um, the guy at Tulane, so he's a hell of a, you know, I do a hell of a job on offense. You know. um, I think, that, yeah, the defensive thing, though, that's what I'm upset with. Those assistants have just messed him up defensively. But so start tomorrow, we're gonna get in practice, and we're gonna I'm gonna take over the defensive part. But uh, um, he's a, you know he's a talented player. You know he's he's, he's just scratching the surface because he, you know, he may get mad when I say this is that when he figures out how to really play, he's gonna be good. He has no idea right now because everything is just you know he just plays. But when he really figures it out, time score and all that, you know we're gonna have a stud here. Second year, I mean, yeah. he, he could be great. You know, I mean, I, I, I will tell you, this offense is not going to be our problem this year. As you can see. I mean, we had a guy that's averaging 19, didn't even play tonight. And so um, um, that won't be our problem. We've got, to, we, we, we've got to continue to get better defensively, and that's something we've talked about. So that's why I was a little disappointed how I started. But, but again, you know, sometimes you got to get other team credit. Um, I'm, I'm really proud of that young man also. I mean, I know how hard that is. I've, I've done that at IEPY and, and be the youngest kill. You know, he, he was trying to act that nervous, but – he, he, was, he was a little nervous, so I told him at the end, man, I'm, I gave him my, my number, and if I can help a guy like that, um, I, I want to do that. Yeah, you know, it, it, but again, you know, part of it, he had his guys ready. He, he's, you know, it's one thing, you know, I, 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 I can sense, just like with players, I can sense a guy that's got a chance to be a pretty good coach. I think, I think he's going to do okay, but I love this team. I, I, I can't. Um, these guys drive me crazy, but I absolutely love this team. I've been doing this for a long time. I coached my son. I've had some great teams. This team here is special. It, it really is. And so I get a little bit upset with them because I, they have no idea how good they can really be. I just want to see us string together some stops. Like I said, we can score with anybody. We've shown that. I think we had multiple dudes get at 20 or close. Like yeah. that's, just, that's just kind of how we play basketball. <laughs> We're a lot better defensively than we showed. We're a lot more versatile defensively than we showed. And I'm glad we got quick turnaround so we can show that pretty quickly. All right, thanks, guys.